A terrarium is any um, garden under glass. It can be fully enclosed or it can just be sitting in a, a glass vessel. It could last forever if you maintain it. With the herbs, you're probably going to have to clip them back. But as long as you keep it out of direct sunlight and keep it properly moist, you could keep it for years and years. It's a fun thing to do, especially if you live in an apartment or don't have a backyard or you can't, don't have a place to enjoy plants. This little glass terrarium will give you pleasure for years and I think it's whimsical and it makes me smile. I'll show you quickly how to make an herb terrarium, which will be a class at the Pennsylvania Herb Festival coming up. First of all, you pick your glass vessel and then at the bottom of the vessel you would put in some rock, any kind of rock like something colorful that's fine also then next you would put in some activated charcoal this helps prevents odors from coming in your terrarium so that activated charcoal you can either buy it at a garden center or you can find it at a fish store they sell, they sell charcoal and then put in your soil just a small layer here spread it around and today I have uh, some different herbs. Today, here's oregano. What you do is get rid of the, some of these longer roots and then set it into the terrarium. And then here's a small thyme plant. Again, stick it in. And then you can fill it in with more soil around it. It's a little dirty, but you know, we'll clean it up. To make the terrarium more attractive, if you have some sphagnum moss or go to the store and buy some, you can put that in around the terrarium so that it looks more attractive. And then the fun part is to put some little treasures in it to give it some whimsy. You can put in marbles. If you have some marbles laying around, just set them in. Or if you have a little frog, which I do have a little plastic toy frog, set him in. And then when you're all done, you can just water it and mist it. Keep it in a, a, a spot that's out of direct sunlight, and you'll have a miniature little greenhouse and something to enjoy all year long.